Hare Krishna. In the spiritual world, we have the Lordships Sri Sri Radha and Krishna. When it comes to Srimati Radharani, she is very, very dear to Krishna. She is the topmost devotee. And whatever services she renders to Krishna, that is the topmost service. Because that gives Krishna the topmost enjoyment or topmost pleasure. Now, Srimati Radharani, when she serves Krishna, she has her sakhis also around to serve Krishna. So, Radharani is instructing the sakhis how to serve. And sometimes, seeing the situation, sakhis, they come forward to serve Radha and Krishna. Now, sakhis have their assistants called manjaris. And these assistants, all the manjaris, they very intimately serve their lordships. So, you see the hierarchy. So, Srimati Radharani is serving Krishna and Radharani is assisted by various Sakhis and these Sakhis have the assistants, they are called as Manjaris. Now, it's a very important thing to note that in our Gaudiya Vaishnava Parampara, all those personalities whom we worship in the altar, they belong to this category called Manjaris. So, the Manjaris have come all the way from spiritual world to deliver all of us. Now, a very, very important thing to understand. So, Manjaris know very well that how they are supposed to assist the Sakhis so that Radha and Krishna can get the topmost pleasure. So, now, Manjaris are the ones who know this very well. And when they come to this material world, they reveal to everyone, what is that, if we do, will give topmost pleasure to Sri Sri Radha and Krishna. And guess what? The Manjuris, that is, all our Acharyas in the Guru Parampara, all of them, they have repeated again and again and again that in the age of Kali Yuga, if the Hare Krishna Mahamantra is chanted, that is the topmost service. Oh, can you imagine? Sakshat, assistants of the Sakhis, who are assistants of Srimati Radharani, they are coming and telling us what is going to give pleasure to Lord Shri Krishna and Srimati Radharani. So, this is a direct service that is coming down directly from the spiritual world. This is a direct service to Srimati Radharani and Shri Krishna. Therefore, when we are chanting this Hare Krishna Mahamantra, one thing has to be very clear. This is not some ordinary service. This is not some service that is given by any Tom, Dick and Harry of this world. This service is given directly by the assistants of Srimati Radharani, that is Manjaris. Therefore, when we are chanting Hare Krishna Mahamantra, we should be very conscious of this one fact, that this service that is given to me by the assistants of Srimati Radharani is the topmost service because this is going to give topmost pleasure to Srimati Radharani and Krishna. So let me try my best to do the service very nicely so that the Lordships will get the topmost pleasure. So today when we are chanting, let's tell ourselves that this chanting of Hare Krishna Mahamantra that I am doing is a direct service to Srimati Radharani and Shri Krishna. Let me do it properly so that I can give them topmost pleasure. So today with this understanding and with this thought that this is the topmost service to the Lordships. And with this conscious mind, conscious uh, endeavor of chanting Hare Krishna Mahamantra attentively, let's begin our chanting. Hare Krishna. <laughs>